Hello guys, I'm Bob. In this video, I'm going to show you the solution to the integration problem of sequence square x over cosecant square x dx. But before I do so, if you guys like the solution, let me press the thumbs up icon below this video. For the first step, we are going to convert sequence square x in the numerator into 1 over cosine square x. And then in the denominator, we are going to convert cosecant square x into 1 over sine square x. And then next, we are going to bring the sine square x up to the numerator and my cosine square x to the denominator. Next, we are going to use the trigonometry identity, the Pythagorean theory, that 1 minus cosine square x is equals to sine square x. So we substitute sine square x as 1 minus cosine square x. Then we split the fraction up into two fractions. One is 1 minus cosine square x. And the other one is cosine square x over cosine square x. And as we know, cosine square x over cosine square x is just basically equals to 1. So we have the integration of 1 over cosine square x minus 1 dx. Then we split this out into two different integrals. The first integral is the integration of 1 over cosine square x. When the second integration will be the integral of 1 dx. The integration of 1 over cosine square x is the same as the integration of secant square x dx. And then we can show we perform our integration. The integration of secant square x dx is tangent x, while the integration of 1 is just basically x. And this will be the final answer to the integration of secant square x over cosecant square x dx. If you guys like this solution, help me press the thumbs up icon below this video and do consider to subscribe to this channel. My name is Bob. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye guys.